Well, if you want, yeah, if, if you want to be a big seller, that's great. But as I say, if you're doing two or three thousand POV a month, there's at least five or six recruits in there. We want you guys to start aiming to bring in a minimum four people per month, and I'm going to show you how to bring them in. Mr. Scott might come along and do a coaching masterclass. Um, I'm going to show you how boot to... camp. <laughs> boot camp. <laughs> Private joke. Sorry, we take a minute to make out of all these masterclass boot camp names. Sorry. Yeah, Private sorry, joke. guys. Um, so masterclass <laughs> boot camp, that mister. Um, you've taken me right off now. You made me giggle. Um, so yeah, Mr. Scott will probably do some work on that with you guys. Um, because you know what? Once you get the confidence, I've had consultants come on this course and they have got left the course, still not bringing anybody in. And then a week after they've left, they've started Ooh. bringing people in and they're on the cruise. Yeah, Lorna Hegarty. Yeah, Leanne Hopgood. Hopgood, you know? And Leanne's actually quit work and that's less than, what, eight months after doing this course? She's quit. A really good job as a pharmacist. So, and if I'm honest, you know, okay, I know it's good off track. Everyone I speak that to. That is team building. Everyone That's I what speak to in, the, in my leadership group, oh, oh, yeah, this course is awesome. So I haven't got a clue what goes on in this course. I'm just here as the ask, but you just need to me, do what. Me neither. Do I the don't challenges, know guys. What we That's all yeah, I can say. do the challenges. Do all of the challenges. As I've already said, um, what else do I want to add? So we're going to teach you how to to recruit we're going to teach you how we built an international team without knowing anybody in any of the countries what like australia and new zealand um and spain and france and spain and france without actually having and to Canada physically move there but we have moved to spain now um we're going to teach you about the 90 day rule when we start heavily working on building a team and we still need to keep up the sales it can take up to 90 days for your first consultant to come in that is perfectly Okay, so I'll talk more about the 90-day rule as we go. Um, leaders know the way, they go the way, they show the way. I them, want we? you guys to be leaders. Behave like directors now. Be positive on your Facebook pages. Um, be uplifting. Be the light. Be the reason why people want to tune into your Facebook page and want to know more about your business because you are happy. Um, and what we teach on this course show your brightest stars in your team okay and finally my big one consistency oh my god consistency is key open the door to your sensi business every single day i would expect that most of you kept the doors open over christmas in one way or another consistency is why scott and i have consistently um been europe's top recruiters for many many years probably up until this year actually if we're honest i think joe just beat us didn't she yeah but well, i will have to say well that's my bad i bought a house and it it took a bit of time up didn't it no it's fine no well we still recruited 40 people last year which is really bad for us <clears> that's that that terrible most people. terrible but for us. let me talk about consistency okay <laughs> it's like just say, you know, it's January. Everybody's hitting the gym because they want to lose 30 pounds, you know? Oh, By yeah. February, they're all sat at home in front of the fire eating I Mars bars I reckon some again. of them are all eating Mars bars now, to be and honest. So you it, know why? Because the goal. Because the goal wasn't good enough. I compare business to exercise. And sometimes you wake up, if you want to exercise, and you think to yourself, I really don't want to do that. Mm. But then you get on and you do it, and you feel better. And you, you, you also, pump. you progress. Yeah. And that's all about your sensory business. Even, we're not saying give up your job and stay awake all night and work 15 hours a day. But even if it's one power hour a day, consistently, yeah. you can grow we will such teach you power an hours. awesome business. Okay, We want you to be posting daily. We want you to be advertising daily. We want you to be opening your shop daily. We want you to be trying to sell daily. One hour a day is a lot better than doing non, four hours a non week hours a day. one day. Yeah. Being awake, showing your customers, showing your team that you're awake one hour a day, and you can really build a great business over that. Okay, it takes a bit more hard work, but this ain't, this ain't rocket science. You don't need to be working it 20 hours a day and like, oh my God, this is my sense of business. I need an office. I need to have a time schedule. Oh, oh my God, I've got to work. I've got to get up at 6 a.m. We've had offices. I'm going to bed at 9 we still sat in the lounge working, didn't we? Yeah, it doesn't... We actually still sat in the lounge and worked. We can't, our our business is run out of a suitcase, guys, and you know, but yeah. we are we turn up to work every single day. It might not be dead on nine o'clock, it might be half six some mornings, it might be eleven AM some mornings, but we turn up to work every single day. And that's all you have to do. And you don't have to work twelve hours a day. 
Just but put be it consistent. Be consistent. Okay, homework time. And I will post this in the box below. Number one, and everybody in our whole group is going to get this when we do our Jumpstart January call tomorrow. So, which would have been today. Oh, well. Do your list of 100. That is something that you should do at least monthly. So, everybody, get out. Big sheets of A4. I want you to post pictures of this when it's done. Do your list of 100 and segment them. Color code them. Do what you like. I want buy, host, and join. If they're all three, brilliant. If they're one, brilliant. We are going to be using that all the way through this course. List of 100. Please have it completed. You have seven days. Like, can I just add something to that? I remember when Alexandra was first asked to do a list of 100, and that words to me was, oh, my God, we knew her. I don't know 100 people. And then suddenly she put her head down, and that list started to really get to 100, you know? Well, it it's was a thousand something now. Fred the Butcher, you know. Fred? Who's Simon Fred? the Postman. We don't have a postman now. But we do have the whole of the Correos post office who do ask about my lovely smelly envelope. So there you go. You know, that's so think hard working about your it, business, right. working your business. Dig deep. Online recruiting pack. I will explain this in detail, but... I want you all to create an online recruiting pack. Kat Banbury and I will share ours. That does not mean please feel free to copy ours and not do your own work. And if you do I'm copy it, for you to... leave the link in, please. Yeah. I'm only joking. Like, develop it. What Awful told us once was, and this is a rhyme my mum gave me, um, it's about being good, get good, then get better, and then become the best. And... That's that good, better, best. Never let it rest till your good is better and your better's best. Do that with these packs. Take what we've done and make it even better. Make it personal. Make it only a few short pages. Make it on white, um, in you know, white copy in Word. Keep it nice and simple. Big letters. The idea of this pack is that when we are doing our work on buy, sell boards and online, that we will be able to send this out to potential consultants. This will also be the backbone of the offline recruiting trifold that you'll be making in a couple of weeks time because you know what? We like to push you. So please don't give me any excuses about why you can't get started on it. Just get it done. You've got seven days and you can use the website story that you updated as part of it. And when I do my recruiting boot camp masterclass... Uh, Symposium <laughs> of excellence. <laughs> this will be vital for that. So get it yeah, done. Well. It does all, it's your sales tool. It's your biggest sales yeah. tool you ever have. And the final one. Um, I'll leave samples till next week. Get your Sensi book. Now, your Sensi book... Um, one of the best tools I was ever taught for selling, and this is, I think, where my sales really began to become really consistently um, about one and a half thousand every single month up to two thousand later on in the year, was when my friend Julie Bennett, who is a quarter of a million seller, by the way, in Sensi, absolutely incredible. She said, oh, I have a book and I write down all my sales in it and then I can keep my customers. Have you not got one? I was like, no. So I did it. So this is my new book. So on one on one side, I'm going to write all my sales. And that keeps a record of what my customers like, what they're buying, what discounts are giving them. And that allows me to go month by month and chase them up because the fortune is in the follow-up. Something we'll be doing later on. In the back, I flip it over and I do all of my recruiting work. So I write my list of potential consultants and how I'm chasing them up and... And Sorry, I do not my beard. Look, he's picking my nose. Not picking my nose. Well, thank you for <laughs> distracting me there. Sorry. Wow. Squirrels. Um, so, yeah, I want you to get your Sensi book. I want you to make it small enough and thin enough that you can take it out and about in your bag. This is your Bible, guys. Keep it with you all the time. If you want to add notes about ideas that you see while you're out and about, do it. If you want to stick your receipts in it, do it. But write your sales and write your potential consultants. Um, arrange your parties in it. Do whatever you like. Page a day diaries are just as good for doing this, by the way, but with a note section at the back for the potential consultants. So that is three things. One, list of 100. Two, online recruiting pack. Three, get your Sensi working notebook. And can I ready. just add something before and we that's go? It. There's something I regularly look at, and you know, this was something Alexandra gave out to all consultants at convention. And always remember this, yeah, I'm not into all this, you know. You know, and this is exactly what we're all about. It's called, it says Team Emerald All Stars, anything but average. 
And always remember that. Don't settle for an average business. Or an average life. Or you deserve more. Life. We're only getting one. Jeez, I was getting to that bit. Well, I no, don't sell for it. don't don't sell for an average life, an average business. Any you on this course and in your business, make sure you fulfil your full potential because as a mentor, and you'll see this as you progress, there's nothing worse than seeing someone with so much potential and they not fulfil it. And we But you know what? Can I just interject? We get very used to this. And whereas before we'd be on your backs and nagging you all the time, now we don't. We move on and work with the workers, don't we? But it's, it's still pretty sad. You. It's still pretty sad to see people with tons of potential. And every single one of you, if you, you've obviously done great sales and really good recruits, and you have potential, make sure you fulfil it. Don't be average. Don't settle for an average life. Don't settle for an average business. Just go out there and make it happen. It doesn't matter what yep. you do. If you believe you'll make it happen, you'll make it happen. If you think this is, you know, this is just some kind Set of... Set the goal and find a way. ...poxy scheme, then you won't make it happen. So there you go. That is it from us. I'm winding it up. It's half an hour. I hope you took a break and got a brew. Watch it back. Um, and let's get the homeworks done. And please, if you have any questions or anything... Leave me a message in the box below. Bye-bye. Bye-bye for now, guys. And remember, you are going to be anything but, but average. average.